Today we're going to talk about wiring your trolling motor batteries in series. Most trolling motors are going to be anywhere from a 12 volt, 24 volt, or a 36 volt. Right now we're going to show you how to wire these two batteries in 24 volt or in series. We're going to call this our low side battery. So this is battery number one. On the positive post of battery number one, we're going to take a jumper wire, which we already pre-made. And we're going to put that on the positive post of battery number one. Battery number two, we're going to connect that to the negative. So we got battery one is 12 volt negative, battery one 12 positive, battery two is now 12 volt positive because of our jumper series, and then battery number two positive is 24 volts. So now to hook your trolling motor up, we're gonna take the two power leads coming from that trolling motor battery. We're gonna hook the black trolling motor lead to battery number one negative, and the positive or red wire from the trolling motor battery to battery number two positive. So we now just powered up this 24 volt trolling motor. We're gonna show you now a little bit more what might seem complex, but it really isn't, a 36 volt system. All you're doing is adding one more battery and one more jumper. So starting from the beginning, we have battery number one. Battery number one negative post is gonna be your trolling motor negative power supply. Battery number one positive post gets jumped to battery two negative. Battery two positive gets jumped to battery three negative. Battery three positive is our 36 volts. So for demonstration purposes, we're just gonna finger tight these. But when you're done with your installation in your actual boat, you're gonna to wanna to take a wrench and torque them down. We can take a multimeter, put it on our DC setting, hold the black end on battery number one negative, and you can just watch the voltmeter. So we'll have 12 volts there. Battery number two will have 24 volts. Battery number three will have 36 volts. 